basement three times the size of the Fenton in Cary will soon start to take shape in Clayton. It's another sign of growth for Johnston County. CBS 17's Judith Retana shows us the unique connection between the developer behind the project and the land it will occupy. This sleepy 300 acre stretch of farmland in Clayton is poised to see new life in the coming years. Growth brings about its challenges, but it brings a lot of opportunities. Dean Penny with Craig Davis Properties says the opportunity here is a new development he's calling the Copper District. The idea is to incorporate street level shopping, dining, and towers with office space and apartment living. Penny plans to include walking trails and several ponds. This will be a very dense development compared to other de traditional developments in Johnston County. The property sits at the I-70 and NC-42 exchange, an area expected to see more growth and traffic in the future. And Johnston County isn't showing any signs of slowing down. The last census data showed that between 2010 and 2020, the county grew by nearly 30 percent, faster than any county in the state. Penny isn't just another developer. He's from Clayton. The land is his family's former Penny Farm. That's the farm that my grandparents bought back in the 1930s. It's the farm my dad grew up on. I spent a lot of my childhood here. He's excited to see it transform. So this is very much a passion project for me to, to bring a style of development with amenities that this area really needs. The family farmhouse and the silo will be preserved and moved. Penny is also saving the original potato house. That's a, a structure that my dad built and so it's personal to me. Prep work has started on the site, but the full build out could take 10 years. For Penny, it's not about doing it fast. It's important to do it in the right way. In Clayton, Judith Ratana, CBS 17 News.